James Bond. Hey, insert name here. What are you doing? Well, it smells in here, so I'm freshening up the place with this can of Febreze I bought at Walmart. You mean the Walmart where they sell for less every day? Yeah! Awesome! Spray some over here! Oh my god! I can't smell anything! What's in that stuff? Well, let's see. Phenol, formaldehyde, water, fragrance, and natural propellant? What was that last one? Natural propellant? No, before that. Fragrance? Keep going. Water? Before that. Formaldehyde. Yeah, that one. Wait, formaldehyde? Do you know what that does? No. Well then, to the World Wide Web! It says here at www.associatedcontent.com slash article slash 54551 how to protect yourself from the dangers.html that formaldehyde is a known carcinogen, meaning that it causes cancer. It is an allergen that can also irritate your eyes, mucose membranes, and the upper respiratory system. It can also cause headaches, rashes, hives, dizziness, nausea, and chronic fatigue. Whoa! That sounds bad! Yeah, that doesn't sound good at all. We better get rid of it. Ew, garbage juice! What are you doing? You can't dispose of it like that. Why not? Because it's the rules. Duh. Well, how do we dispose of it then? It says on mon monsterjanitorial.com that the only proper way to dispose of this death trap we call Febreze is to slowly pour it down the sewer with excess water, then to dispose the empty can into the garbage. There. Now the sewer's clean, too. Hey, insert name here. What are you doing now? I'm just brushing my teeth. With that much toothpaste? You know. You use more toothpaste than I do. I may be a noob, but at least I'm not a noob who's at risk of fluorosis. Touché, but how am I at risk for fluorosis? Well, many websites on the internet, such as fluoridealert.org, tell us that too much fluoride can cause us to develop spots or discoloration or even pitted teeth. Okay, well how much is too much? You should use about the same size as a pea when brushing your teeth. But did you know brushing only kills 20% of bacteria in the mouth? Brushing, and then using Listerine, can, up, can kill up to 99% of germs in your mouth. And flossing can increase this past 100%. Wow, I didn't know that. Thanks. Now I can brush my teeth, floss, and then use Listerine to make my mouth is always spick and span. Oh! Looks like the tube's empty. Should I throw it out? Yeah, I don't see any harm in doing that. Oh my god! It seems as though I've mistaken my blue colored water I poured earlier with actual Febreze. What should I do? Hold on! I'll call poison control because that's what it says on the back of this bottle. See, I read it in advance, just in case of an emergency. Which what you should do with all your hazardous products. Ah, don't you hate it when you pee on your hands? Dude, didn't you wash your hands? Yeah, dude, I used hand sanitizer.